Hello, this is Chase Bliff here again with another video. This time I'm going to show you how I fixed my Section 8 startup problem. Okay, so what happened was when I used to go to Steam, um, basically when I click play on Section 8 Prejudice, it would come up with the loading box as if it was going to play, and then just not play. It just it just disappear. Honestly, have not got a clue where it went to, but yeah. And I found out that I need games of Windows Live installed on the computer before it would run properly. For some reason, nothing told me this. I didn't know that I needed to install Games Windows Live, and there was no sort of hints or anything like that. Even when you started the game up, it did not say, "Oh, you need Windows Live games." So basically, I had to look through the root files of the program in the program files section and find out where it is. And it's dead. See, it's dead. Really simple. Basically, it's just in Steam. So well, the old programs files, Steam. Steam apps, it's in common, and then it's in, let the video catch up, where is it? <sighs> yeah, I was basically trying to wing the video, so, just speaking over the top of it, giving you a commentary now. Okay, yeah, so Steam apps, common, go to section 8 prejudice, and then it's in the readist file. I'll, uh, in the video now, I'll spend a bit of time messing around, so yeah in none of these files I'm currently looking through it's in the readist file and basically it's an execution file for games for Windows Live it's dead recognizable you know, there's no way you'd miss it and um, what you need to do is basically just install that into your computer and then you're sorted you'll have no problem then at all, at all basically hopefully with any startup issues here we go that one there that file setup for Windows Live games and then you'll be sorted. See, I've already installed it, so it pops up with a message saying, Ooh, install success. Blah, blah, blah. You sign in. I'll show you what happens now. Games Windows Live Marketplace pops up. You'll have to make an account probably within the Games Windows Live if you haven't already got one. Um, also, the same as uh, an Xbox Live gamer tag. If you've already got one of them, just use that with the email address you sign up for it. And away you go. You'll be sorted. Um, this is just me showing you what the Marketplace looks like close and you'll know if it's worked because you'll go to steam click on section 8 prejudice it'll do that and then it will pop up with the section 8 prejudice box and then you'll know you're happy you're sorted hopefully that was my problem the fact that I didn't have games for Windows Live it needs to be a bit more clear to be honest a bit poorly made but it's a great game give it a chance even if people do you know say it looks a bit like halo for the ps3 to be honest with you it's already out for the xbox as well and the pc and so you know plenty of people love this game i'm sure and yeah, there it is straight away game swindles live pops up and off you go if you haven't played this game i'd definitely give it a chance give it a go it's worth having a play but anyway yeah thanks for watching and if it helped you thumbs up and subscribe thank you cheese out